Just shut the door. Okay. What's well, good, everybody? Grand Rising, good morning, good day, whatever you like to say. It's a beautiful day in the UK. So I'm up bright and early. Um, my kids are still sleeping. So that means I get to test out my new hair product. <laughs> this is a gift from my sister for Christmas. Um, so a little bit about my hair, let's start there. So right now, obviously I'm naturally curly. This is my natural hair, natural color, natural everything. Um, I did a big chop about like two years ago after I had my son, my firstborn. Um, I had dreadlocks for a few years. Um, yeah, so then I cut them after I had the baby and then I was just pretty much bald. So I'll show some pictures here about like all my hairstyles and everything. I've done everything in the book. I've had my regular curly hair, I've blow dried it, I've flat ironed it, I've burnt it to a crisp, I've gotten micro braids, I've gotten box braids. Um, my grandma's done so many types of braids on me. Um, pretty much just like trying to find myself through my hair all these years and it's been a journey. Like I've done full locks, I've done, I've dyed it every color. I went blonde so many years. I went blonde and broke it all off. Started from scratch again. And <laughs> it's just been wild, like literally. Like every few months, I feel like I've been, you know, changing stuff. But since I've been a mom, obviously, like I've wanted things that have been low maintenance and just, you know, just things that are like easy to do but still look nice. But whatever. I just, you know, I had two kids back to back, so obviously I've been just getting back into the groove of like, okay, what's next? Like, what's is there you know, a new hair for me or this? Anyway, so this is all the hair growth I've had since my big chop. Like I went low, low, low. So this is about two years of full growth and I have not straightened my hair in what? I think eight years. Like my husband hasn't even seen me with blown out straight hair. Obviously my kids haven't seen me, <laughs> you know, like that. So this is exciting. I haven't done this in a while. And luckily like, hair products and hair styling tools and just things have gotten so much more like mixed girl friendly, a lot healthier. There's more methods to do things a lot healthier. Like 20 years ago, it was not like that. You either get a texturizer, a perm or, you know, like, oh my gosh, I've been through it all. Literally seeing this, I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to get this. Like, look at this. You just know it's made for this kind of hair. You can just tell. So I'm really excited to do it. It's pink and black, my favorite colors my whole life, so. You know what they say, once you go black, you're gonna need a wheelchair. Alrighty, so my hair's already dampened, it's already washed, dried, um, or washed, conditioned, leave-in condition, detangled, all those steps you already know for a curly girl. I wash and conditioned with Cantu um, avocado shampoo and conditioner, and then this, I've been using this for years, the leave-in conditioner from Cantu. So yeah, I already have a little bit in my hair. I don't wanna put too much product to weigh down my hair, cause it's very like, it's very like light, like in feathery, but still thick at the same time. I don't know how that works. There's all these new terms today of like describing hair. I think I'm like, what, three, three C, three B and C all around. Maybe like a three C on the top, three B at the bottom. You guys can help me out in the comments and let me know what it is. Um, and I'm using this as a heat protectant. It's a 10 right here. All these products are good. Pretty expensive too, but you know, well, I mean, to find expensive, whatever. You want your hair to be taken care of. So I'm going to start with the bottom section, just like, kind of like, it back. I'm not really gonna part all seriously because I don't think you have to. I'm gonna put my hair like up like this. I think that's good. And then I'm gonna just twist and banana clip the top. You can never have too many of these. My husband's like, oh, you know, banana clips actually, you know, they're not really safe because if you get into a car accident, they actually have seen studies of it being lodged into your brain. I'm like, thanks. Just another thing to add to my list to worry about or think about, like, what? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. So I'm gonna split it right down the back. Just like so. 
I am going to take my detangling brush. Look how cool it is. I think I got this for like seven, eight bucks, or under 10 bucks on Amazon. And this has detangled my hair the best that anything ever has. Like only a very little bit of hair comes out every time. I'm very shocked because it's fully detangled after. Like I said, products upgrading. They're being a lot more mixed girl friendly. So I really appreciate who's taking their time to do that. So I'm gonna just lightly detangle again, because you know, the minute you detangle your hair and it dries as a curly girl, somehow it can re-tangle itself. That's why I got dreadlocks in the first place because I'm like, oh, my hair's naturally like locking itself if I don't comb it, so I must need locks. And then I had locks, because my husband has locks, obviously, so I started doing it. Well, he had it before me, and then I started, I'm like, yeah, I can do it too. So we had our locks for a bit. It was really cute. I dyed them blonde. I had to actually dye them blonde, interlock them, and just rustle and tussle with them to just keep them locked because my hair was like, yeah, I can knot up pretty good, but I'm still too slick and silky to stay locked. So you gotta manipulate it a lot. And that got exhausting, especially having a baby. So yeah. Okay, so I did this side right here. Ugh, honestly, like I'm so nervous. I'm just like, oh, I wanna keep my hair healthy. Like I'm gonna be really careful. You know, I don't wanna have to trim my ends too much because my hair is growing. And But you have one life to live, apparently. So if you live it well, live it right, one is enough. So just do things that make you happy and you know, it, just be, it was just Mother's Day, what, the other day, yesterday, two days ago, and I woke up feeling really grateful, you know, for my life, it just happy. I feel like I'm at a place in my life where, like, I just accept myself, I really do. So, like, I'm just really all about doing things that make me feel good, make me feel comfortable, make me feel happy unapologetically. Okay, I think that's good. All right, so, I'm gonna use it. It's a 10. The 10 things that it's good for is uh, maintenance of keratin, styling for all hair types, replaces protein in the hair, protects the natural keratin in the hair, protects against heat, restores hydration, detangles, frizz, adds shine, helps strengthen hair, seals cuticles for extra silky hair. So I'm sold. It's a 10 for me. So I'm going to take it. Well, let's see. Shampoo and condition hair, towel dry, spray all over hair and comb through. So I'm gonna do each section because my hair is obviously thick. Get those ends. Oh, wow, it's like a nice consistency. I like that. Okay, I think, yeah, I think that's good. And it smells nice. It's such a small bottle for the price. It's like, what, 30 bucks for this little bottle? How many ounces? Four ounces, wow. So I guess a little goes a long way. As you can see, it fully re-dampened my hair. Oh yeah, all right. Moment of truth. Let me turn it on like this. There's an off, cool, low, and high. I think that's all you need, right? Let's try low. So that's the low setting. Um, honestly, I don't think I need to go to high, but maybe I'll just, I'll try it out. It's getting a little like more stuck at the ends, but the ends are the ends of the hair. Everybody knows how that goes. And I guess I could use a little trim, but let's keep going. Let's kick it up to high and see what high is saying. Wow. Whoa. 
Wow, look at that. Oh my goodness. Wow, I have not seen my hair like this in so long. Look at the length difference. Like look at the, oh my Lord. It like doubles in length. Can you see that? And nice. I would say, and you just go straight to high, if anything, just go low and slow with high and just get it over with, you know? Maybe low is like if you're like retouching up or something, but just go, yeah, I would just go straight to high and keep it pushing. Oh, shit. Yeah, my ends could use a trim, but. It's a little tougher at the ends. Put it through. This is really fast too. And I have no intentions of flat ironing my hair. I also don't even own a flat iron right now. I've got rid of all that stuff years ago. So it says one step. I guess this is all I'm going to need. And it seems that way. I'll try to get closer to the root this time. What the fuck? Oh my god, you're kidding. It stopped working and it's like frying. Oh my God, it's smoking. Oh shit. Oh no. That's like not good at all. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. And I'm sitting here all excited, ready to do this. Now I have straight hair on the bottom. Is that smell coming from my hair? No, it's coming from this. What the fuck just happened? So I guess I can't even finish, I can't use it. You know when they say like, you're about to get to the next level, do the next thing, like, and things happen? I don't know if I'm superstitious or, I always feel like that. So obviously good's gonna come after this, but fuck. I can't even finish. And it looks so beautiful. It, like my hair looks so long. Like I look like a whole different person. A whole brand new. I can't even sing the song fully yet because I'm not. I'm not even a quarter of the way there. Oh my God, I can't even believe this. I can't believe this. It's, oh my God, I don't know. Oh, look how nice. Like my whole head was gonna be like this. Low maintenance, my hair is so long and shiny and beautiful. Oh, oh my God, it looks so... Yeah, that's not my hair smelling like that. That's the tool. And I heard it popping, right? Like cackling, like I'm like, maybe it shouldn't be doing that. And now it's like, don't use me, please. Well, as you can see, it does the job. It really does. I totally recommend it. Like, look at that, like, oh my, look at my hair. It looks so nice. And I wasn't even, I'm not even done. Like, I'm not even close. Oh, look how long it is. I was trying to give my husband a whole new wife today. I now have to wait and then do another video. Even if I put it on low, let's try again. It's overheated, it's so hot. I can't even put it on. Like you can tell like so, it's, something's messing with the mechanism. All right guys, well, that is the Revlon One Step. Okay, well, I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> to be continued. <laughs>